Well, hello, train fans. I'm somewhere a little bit different today. Um, I'm at the Eden Valley Railway in Warcop, which is just one a little bit over from Penrith. But what's this doing here? It's preserved, of course, but I'm going to show you around. Let's go and have a little look inside the unit. That's the driving cab in there. Just put my phone in and you can have a look at the cab. Got the gear selector where your master key goes in. Power notches one, two, three, four. And the Westinghouse and EP brake, train horn, speed and brake gauges, AWS fan, modern technology, and that is the handbrake. These these SEP units, corridor electro-pneumatic, used to run in the southern region, Ramsgate, um, and this one particularly, this particular unit was um, used on the southwestern main line, as the map indicates. Intercity 70 seats, trinket tables. Unfortunately, the double glazing has blown a little bit, um, but that was a pretty common trait on these units. Fluorescent tube lighting, you can probably hear the buzz of the uh, PA system. And uh, yeah, there we are, Southwest trains. Priority seating, as it were. Let's head through towards first class. Unfortunately, we can't get through the whole train because they're still re doing restoration work, but we can definitely have a look at how it's slide back closed. The vestibule ends. Now these are notorious for their big, their yellow formica plastic ends. It's got that real oldy worldy smell to it as well, which we like. Now when you go to the first class compartment. There was a second class compartment on its own, and the seats were slightly smaller, which meant there was a space for luggage. But it was always second class, and not many people could sort of differentiate it. So they would always walk past it, and this would always be more or less empty. But if we go past the parcel area, just in there space for baggage and bikes and parcels and things that used to be carried, and past the uh, guard's office, that's the PA control and internal communications, and up above the door there is the buzzer for the, um, for the uh, uh, dispatching of the train, the brake pipes, testing the brakes and stuff. But then through here is first class. And here we've got much bigger, wider seats, nice carpet, table, first class headrests, and we've even got the Edward Pond murals on the wall as well. Reclining seats, which are done by these toggles here, you slide yourself forward and backwards, it gives a bit of climb. And again, unfortunately, those windows are very blown. And there were four first class compartments, there's another one curtains as well at the windows. So, yep, this is a class 411 SEP unit and there is a lot of, a lot of nostalgia here, especially for me because I used to, uh, this is what we used to get down through Ashby. But I thought it'd be worth showing the unit. I'm just going to shut the door behind me. So there we go. A class 411 set, which stands for Corridor Electro Pneumatic. That's the compressor, and they also have a class. 205 thumper and another SEP unit just there as well. Oh, and a class 47. But there we go. I thought I'd show you that. I thought it'd be something a bit different for you to see on my channel. But there we are. 2315.